whole dark and scary mood we've got going here. Monica, stop! We're not gonna stand by and let you do this! I do think if you shiny, fabulously designed outfits are going to stop me. Thank you. <laughs> All right, now either grab a roll of TP and help us decorate, or get out of the way, because nothing stops the night of the Zomboids! left in there. Maybe I can... It is very nice to meet you, Snap. Yeah! Oh, maybe we can just bow. Snap, snap, snap. Oh, oh. <laughs> cool. So, Ghouls, now that we have our fierce new looks, what do you say we head over to the power station and see if Cleo's ready for tonight? Let me catch up with you. I have to check on something first. But while all of us monsters find spiders like Webby here to be charming and wonderful creatures, it is important to remember that whenever a human sees a spider, they do this. <clears throat> Any questions? Ah! Got it. Very good. Then we are moving on to our next humanology subject. Darkness. Now, who can tell me what human beings think about the dark? I know, I know. I got it. Oh, I got this I one. Know. Uh, Professor, yeah. Professor Dracula, oh, oh. I know. <clears throat> Claudine Wolf. Uh, oh, uh, they, they think it's clawsome because it is? Absolutely wrong. Humans are scared of the dark. <laughs> What's to be scared of? Look out! There's some darkness behind you! Ah! Yes, yes, I know it's peculiar, but it's true. Humans cannot see in the dark like vampires or werewolves. Normies are afraid of the dark. Professor Dracula, if the humans are so scared, then why don't they just suck up a light bulb like Gob? <laughs> Uh, are you sure this looks good? Absolutely. It makes you look at least 10,000 years younger. I'm 
not so sure about that. Hey, love the new look, Dracula. Well, what do you know? So do I. I'm very proud of you, Claudine. Thanks, Mom. Something wrong? Frankie should be here. Just wondering where she is. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. <coughs> Could you? No peeking. Okay, Goulds. Here goes. Oh, Claudine! I knew you could oh, do it, Claudine. Terrific! You really like them? Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't wait to wear these at the salon opening tonight. They are fantastic! Thanks! All my inspiration was thanks to you and the ghouls. But I still think there's something missing. Hey, ghouls! Sorry I'm late. I just got this big burst of energy! So I decided to walk around the school 14 times, you know, after I did the humanology reading assignment. Um, who broke Frankie? Oh, and then he did the rest of the reading for the next two semesters! <gasps> hey, look at that, Claudine! Those looks are so voltageous, I knew you could do it. Hey, do I sound like I'm talking fast? I'm talking fast, aren't I? Frankie, Frankie, slow down! How many mummy mochas did you drink, huh? Why, I've never been so full of energy that's a great idea. I'll go get us all some mummy mochas. I'll be right back. Uh, ow! Woo! Whoa, 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 no! Why don't we sit down for a minute? It's like there's too much electricity inside her. She's all amped up. Oh, oh no, my dress! Place around it. Did you hear that? Huh? Oh, what's going on? It sounded electrical. So rude. I think we'd better do something. Of course. But will we still have time for a bite before? Here. In the alley. Oh, where did it go? Ghouls, let's move. with truth. Oh, I know, I know. What's your biggest dream? What do you want to do when we don't have to hide from the humans? Well, um, when I was a were-pup, we lived in a dark, dingy den. There was no style, no art. But then, Monster High found me. And I discovered how good it made me feel to be creative and to create for others, too. So, my dream is to open a salon. A place for everybody, humans and monsters alike. And I want to be the head stylist that makes them all say, Oh! <laughs> <laughs> 